Uh, welcome to Mobile Electronic Diagnostic Honda Odyssey 2005. Key have an issue. Let us go and uh, cut another one and program it for him. Car, Honda Odyssey. Some of them they come with another remote that is have a sliding door. You see there. So this remote here is only for door lock and unlock, but it's not originally for the car. The car comes with a regular regular key and no remote you know like remote is hanging here not one unit so we are going to turn our machine on and we try to add this key i already cut one the same one it door lock and unlock only so i'm gonna go here clean all the aspects and then we're gonna click here you have to put the key on the original key this is a security light go off and this is for all Honda that using this kind of key, regardless of whether it's Accord, Civic, Honda CRV, Honda Odyssey, Honda Accord, Pilot, they all. Ignition is on 2005. It will it will read the VIN number easy. Automatic selection. Okay, I'm gonna go on. I'm gonna keep this one here for now. Please subscribe, share, and like. And this is Honda, as you see. If this is 2005 Honda Accord, what do you think about 2021 Honda Accord? I mean, Honda Honda Odyssey. What do you think about 2021? It's gonna be beautiful, marvelous. So if you have a car, please always stay with the spare key. This one is gonna take from one minute to three minutes. Uh, battery voltage, always check the battery voltage. And let's go ahead. This key here is not the original key, but it have a Dura shell, a uh, shell that is very strong and it stay longer and resist opposite the, the one that uh, it have a screw here. If you have a shell that have a screw here, try to get this one is more better. Even if you pay two, three, four dollar extra, this one can last longer. Also, the original one, one button is not working. You see this one here work? Here work, but the original one, one of those buttons, this one doesn't work. After I finish this, I'm trying to see if I will be able to, uh, I will be able to fix this button to work. You can desolder it, put another new one and solder it and it will work. I'm, I'm not gonna give up, I will check it now. This take long time to configure the system. You're just going to go and add a key. And by the way, this, what I'm doing here for Honda Odyssey, Honda CRV, Honda, all kind of Honda, it takes the same, the same. Okay, now third generation mechanical key. Okay, I'm going to go here. It will re-scan again, just to be sure that the, the, the car shows the right one. Because uh, the EPROM is very small. I'm gonna uh, wear all key loss guide. Add a key. Add a key, have one, two, three, four, five step. I would say yes. Already the key in the ignition. Insert the key to be registered. Turn the ignition on. The key is already on. Succeed. Succeed. Read. Key number is one. Turn the ignition off within 15 seconds. On. With, this, with, the, with the register key within 17 seconds. Now succeed the last one. You want to learn next key? You see now there, it's blinking faster. I will say yes. We are inside the programming. Now turn the ignition off within 15 seconds. Ignition there is blinking. I, take, I turn it off, I took it out. So now put the new key and turn the ignition on. To the new key. In Toyota, you don't turn the in Toyota, you do not turn the ignition on. Okay. Key program. So do you wanna do you wanna like to learn the next one? No. Turn the ignition off. On. 
look at the green light. Two, three, four, turn the ignition off. Turn the ignition off, we set it on. One, done. Establish communication. We're gonna ask you, is the green, does the immobilizer indicator lamp go out? I say yes. Now, everything will look okay. Turn the ignition off. Turn the ignition on. Everything good. I have two keys. I'm gonna start the car with a new key. This key is working fine. Thank you for watching Mobile Elec Thank you for watching Mobile Electronic. Please subscribe and share and see you in another video. This is Muhammad Harun Idris.